I've always wanted one thing in my life, and that's to have really juicy lips. You've got pretty juicy lips, I'm going to be honest. They do okay, but I do overline. Like, I do trick people into thinking I have juicier lips than what I do. But I always find myself down these, like, rabbit holes of trying to find the easiest way to get plumping lips. I'm not a big fan of lip glosses, and I feel like lip glosses are the ones that always have, like, that heat element, Mm. whether it's, like, chili or, like, mint that, like, has that plumping element. But I'm not a fan of lip glosses, so I try to do it in a way where I can still wear my lipstick. I saw this video that um, had Anne Hathaway in it, and I know you've seen this video. I've seen this video, but let's talk about it. So she's getting ready for a photo shoot, and she's talking to the camera, and she's like, I have a hack on how to make my lips look full and bigger. Firstly, Anne Hathaway has really big lips in general. (laughs) Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous person. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Um, so she says that while she's getting her hair and makeup done, she borrows a bobby pin from a hairstylist and uses the prong end of the bobby pin to tap the cupid's bow of her lip. And she'll just keep tapping it and tapping it until I think like the blood circulates to that area and makes it look fuller. Yeah. And then she's like, I do that up until like the video, the photo shoot starts. So she's just like there tapping her lips. Tapping her lips. Everyone's doing her hair and makeup. Yeah. And they're like, there she is with her bobby pin. And look, I'm going to be honest. When I watched that video, her lips look the exact same. Yeah. So, <laughs> and? so I don't know if this is more of like a mental thing. Like maybe it gives her some confidence. But surely like I've seen people try to do it. You've tried to do it, I think, in the past. Look, <laughs> I did it at, for a, a tried and tested article on Mamma Mia. As I said, I've got the tiniest little lips and I tried it. It, I thought my lips looked a little better, but the, when I did the before and after together, it was like, baby, you okay? Like, I'm same. wearing lipstick right now, which mm-hmm. is what she is in the video. So she already has her makeup done and she's wearing lipstick and she's just like tapping away. So I'm going to do this right now. I'm going to pull up a mirror so I can see what I'm doing. Okay, get your mirror. Get my mirror. Oh, this is a big boy. Jeez. She's got her mirror oh out. God. Thank God I've been it is out. a massive mirror. This is a- <laughs> Who do you think you are, Anne Hathaway? It's got little see, lights on it and everything. I'm sitting down, but I can see my entire body. <laughs> this mirror's massive. Okay. Okay, so I've got I've got a bobby pin with me. It took me really long to find this. Just the one bobby pin. No one in we the office We won't explain why. A bobby pin. We won't explain why, but I got my hands on one. So I'm just going to sit here. And I'm just. So gonna how tap. long do you do it for? She did it for like... I think it was like 10 to 20 minutes. 10 to 20 minutes? Because like she was just sitting in that chair doing it. No? I think she says you don't have to do it for longer <laughs> than 30 lie? seconds. <laughs> I think you lied to me. Okay. So basically, you, I think the thought behind not doing it for more than 30 seconds yeah. is because your lips are obviously like quite sensitive. So you don't want to oh, okay. bruise them. You don't want to kind of keep going over them for See, ages. because I would just keep doing this until something happens. <laughs> Like whether that's like I bleed out or I don't know. <laughs> Bigger lips or I also or feel really stupid right now. Surely but you know when you you, say, you you know there might be more behind just a simple bobby pin. I do also movement. think she's having like a bit of a resurgence right now. Like she's everywhere. She's got like that new stylist. She's been looking really good recently. She's changed. She's, she's changed. changed it up a little she bit. She was in that new movie with that hot young guy. Like I think everyone is just really paying a lot of attention to her. And I think... She can get away with doing just something. being like, with saying something like this, <laughs> like saying like, just tap your lip with a bobby pin. <laughs> also, nothing's happened. I've been tapping all the way this whole so time. So you've just been doing your top lip, not if your- anything. I've taken off my lipstick. Oh, yeah, you can and see I've a bit also, of lipstick on like, the end. Pushed my lipstick above my lip, so I just look silly. So I feel like you'd obviously use this before lipstick. Yeah. It kind of, my lips kind of feel a bit numb now, like that feeling you do get when you wear like a tingly lip gloss. Yeah. But at what cost? <laughs> at what cost, Anne? I can't be doing this. Firstly, finding a bobby pin. Not all of us have a stylist ready on hand to give us one. I think because it is such a simple hack though, these are the kind of ones that you want to try. Yeah. Because you're like, oh, I feel like they do look a little plumper. Mm, maybe. Your top lip. I think you're lying. Thank you so much for listening to this episode of Tried and Tested. That was fun. That was so much fun. I love giving nails. <laughs> she loves the like nails. Doing our job. We hope you took a couple of tips away <laughs> from that. You Beauty is produced by Cassie Merritt with audio production by Lou Hill and video production by Julian Rosario. We will see you next week. Bye. Bye.